Welcome to the research on the comparison of the ability in learning and identifying traditional and simplified Chinese. Let's begin now. First word, vehicle. The ancient word looked just like the side view of a vehicle with wheels on both sides. After a while, it evolved to be more like the top view of a vehicle. The wheels becomes two strokes, while the body stayed the same. The simplified form further simplified the body part. Next, crowd. The original meaning is three slaves working under the sun. The word sun gradually evolved to become a circle with a stroke inside. But someone mistakenly added one more stroke into the sun, which became the traditional form. The simplified form only keeps the three slaves. Next word, nation. The word originally represents a guard holding a weapon, defending his territory. Later on, a circle. And then a square was added to the outside, and the inner part was complicated with more strokes, which became the traditional form. The simplified form then simplified the inner part, showing a king staying inside the square, and then a point was added. Next word, pen. The original word looks just like holding a pen. The upper right part stands for the hand, while the left part is the bamboo stick. After a while, the symbol for bamboo was added to the top of the word, and finally became the traditional form of this word. The simplified form keeps the upper part, but changes the lower part. To mean a pen is made of the bamboo and animal fur. Next word, tooth. The word originally represents a mouth with upper teeth and lower teeth, and later on it was complicated by a mark that represents the molar, which formulated into the traditional form. The simplified form maintains the basic contour, but decreases the inner four teeth to one. Next word, through. The original meaning is silk placed on a machine through racks. The left part means silk, while the right part looks like three threads of silk placed through racks. The simplified form. Reduces the number of strokes for representing the silk. Next word, door. The traditional form of the word is almost the same as its ancient script. The simplified form further simplified the upper part of the portal. Next word, dragon. The original word looks like a big snake. Wearing a crown. Later on, the lower left part evolved to be like teeth and mouth, and the right part represented the fins of the dragon. The simplified form adopted the scribbled version, which was created by calligraphy artists. Next word, to draw. The ancient script of the word represents a hand grabbing a brush pen to draw. Later on, both the upper and lower parts were complicated with more strokes in becoming the traditional form. The simplified form simplifies both upper and lower parts and mimics the regular script. Next word. Wheat. The ancient word is a picture of a strand of wheat. After a while, it evolved to become the traditional form of this word.
The simplified form combines the word "come," which means wheat comes from foreign countries. In this way, the upper part of the word is simplified. Next word, bird. The ancient script of the word exactly sketches the appearance of a bird. The traditional form transforms the head part, and uses four points to represent the feather and the claws. The simplified form further simplifies the head part, and uses one horizontal bar to replace the four points. Next word, chicken. The original meaning is a kind of big bird captured by a person to be kept at home. The left part of the word stands for a person using a rope to tie up a bird which is on his right side. The simplified form greatly reduces strokes on the left side, while using the simplified word "bird" on the right side. Next word, to fly. The word represents wings with feather waving and flying in the air. The simplified form reduces the two wings with feather into one. Next word, flourish. The ancient word is the drawing of a tree with flowers. The traditional form basically keeps this shape with horizontal and vertical strokes. The simplified word replaces the upper part with the word "hua," which means change. Next word, lightning. The traditional form represents the rain in the air. And the lightning comes down from the sky. The simplified form deletes the rain part, and only keeps the lightning part. Next word, to learn. The original drawing of feather and the nest together means young birds learning to fly. Later on, some strokes were added. To the lower part to become the traditional form of this word, the simplified form only keeps the upper left or left part of the word. Next word, to advance. The ancient script shows a foot following a bird, meaning walking and advancing. The traditional form complicates it with more strokes. The simplified form. Replaces the bird part with the word "well," because its pronunciation is similar to the word "to advance." Next word, music. The ancient word stands for a wooden rack with silk or string on it, which means an instrument and music played by it. The traditional form basically keeps the original format, while the simplified form greatly reduces the upper part of the word. Next word, to open. The traditional form represents two hands touching the locking bar in order to open the door. The simplified form deletes the outer parts, and only the inner parts remain. Next word, conspicuous. The left side of the ancient word stands for silk under the sun, while the right side represents the head of a person. Together, it means a person can see thin silk clearly because of sufficient sunlight. The simplified form keeps the left side and simplifies the silk part. Next word. To end. The ancient script represents that after dining, a brush is used to clean the bowl. The traditional form increases the strokes to become more complicated. The simplified form adopts the word created by calligraphy artists to reduce the strokes of both upper and lower parts. 
Next word, to produce. The ancient word means a person using tools and past experience to produce crops. The bottom part looks just like growing crops. The simplified form only keeps the upper part. Next word, justice. The ancient script shows a sheep on the top and war at the blow. In the ancient time, before initiating a war, worshiping was necessary. The sheep was used to worship, and means auspicious. The simplified form uses a cross meaning to kill, and a point meaning righteous to mean. It is righteous to kill. Next word, disorder. The ancient drawing means scrabbled and strangled silk on a rack. This meaning further implies things in disorder. The simplified form basically keeps the outer shape of the left side. Next word, dust. The ancient script shows two or three deers running. Later on, the soil ground was added to the lower part, and only one deer was left at the upper part. This means that when a group of deers are running by, dust would be all over the air. The simplified form further simplifies the upper part with the word small. Which makes the whole word means small soil or dust. The research is completed. Thanks for your time and effort. Goodbye.